Hi, I'm Andy Peel from the CCDC. Welcome to this video on how to use the Structure Overlay tool in Mercury. To begin, launch Mercury. We will compare the structures of two related germanium compounds with CSD ref codes NAKCIN and NAKCEJ. To start, type the ref code of one of these structures in the Structure Navigator. Here we will use NAKCIN. Now that one structure is loaded, tick multiple structures and click structures to open up the multiple structures window. Type the second ref code, NAKCEJ, in the Structure Navigator and you will see that it has now appeared in the multiple structures window and also in the main visualizer area. To make it easier to compare the structures, select local rotation centers and move the structure that is nearest the mouse cursor. You can now reposition these to make them easier to compare. From the top toolbar, tick Show Labels, and from the drop-down options, select Non-CH. You can see a common labeling scheme is used for these structures. Go to the Calculate menu and select Structure Overlay. This will open the Structure Overlay window. In the table, you will see the column headings Atom 1, Atom 2 and Distance. You need to select at least one pair of atoms to use the overlay, but you may select more depending on what you wish to compare. Clicking on atoms P1 in NAKCIN and P1 in NAKCEJ adds them to the structure overlay window and reports the current separation corresponding to the length of the yellow dotted line. We can do the same for the GE1 and P2 pairs of atoms. Once this is done, clicking Overlay performs the calculation and superimposes the molecules in the visualizer. The separations in the distance column have reduced to close to zero, which together with the low RMS value indicates a very good fit based on the selected atoms. In the multiple structures window, unticking Move the structure that is nearest the mouse cursor and selecting Global Rotation Centers allows you to move the structures without disrupting the overlay. You can see that it is only the differences in the germanium to halogen distances and angles that are significant. In the Display Option toolbar, tick Packing to view the unit cell contents. Click Overlay again to superimpose the packed structures. You will see that the remaining pairs of molecules are also quite well matched based on our comparison of a single pair of molecules. You can change the colour of the structures from the multiple structures window using the drop down menu in the colour column to highlight the differences. Here we choose red and blue. It is also possible to save the structure overlay to continue working with it in the future. To do so, go to the file menu, select save as and choose an appropriate directory. Select the file type as .myx and click Save. This can be reopened via File and Open from the top menu. You can explore the tool further using this example. Try deleting the currently overlaid atoms from the Structure Overlay table and instead use all pair of germanium atoms that are currently close to one another in the overlaid packing view. See what happens to the RMS value when you do this. To summarise, we have seen how the Structure Overlay tool in Mercury can be used to compare related molecules and structures, and how to effectively visualise, manipulate and save the overlaid structures. We hope that you've enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.